Today we will be applying a gold design and transferring on vehicles using metallic decals. Unlike our other videos, we will not be printing gold on the paper and transfer. Instead, we will be using a film-free metallic paper to print a black and white image. Then, using a laminating machine, transfer a very thin gold film on top of the black ink. By transferring the actual gold film, we are trying to make the image look more like real gold and not some cheap junk. This is also a perfect way to promote your business by applying company logos or phrases in gold. Otherwise, you can have other cool designs on your cars to impress your friends. All you need is the papers, printer, laminating machine, dryer, scissors and squeegee rubber. So without further ado, let's check it out. First, print on the blue decal paper. Then, place the gold foil on top. Make sure that the film face is up. Feed the overlapping papers through the laminating machine at 120 degrees lowest possible speed. You might have to glue the top end of the foil to avoid forming wrinkles. Peel off the gold film, leaving only the printed parts with foil. Next, laminate for the second time, but with the coating paper. This time, dab the blue decal with wet tissue and remove it. Cut out the image. Immerse in water, then take it out. You want to make sure that the film comes off loose before applying them on the car surface. As you all know, apply the W1 where the decal will be applied. Generally, car dead decals are quite large, so make sure you squidgy excess moisture and air thoroughly. Repeat the same steps on the other side of the car. You will find glue and water dripping everywhere, so you might have to wipe that off as well. Finally, we want to blow dry for 3 minutes. Remove the film. And then blow dry again for another extra 3 minutes to make sure that the film stays stronger and waterproof. We would not recommend overheating the decal as this could burn the ink when you remove the film. If you're not confident that you will achieve the best results, don't bother removing the film. You can still achieve the best results even if you don't remove the film. The film edges are not noticeable unless you look closely. If you want to remove the image later on, use nail polish remover to give it a gentle scrub. Make sure you don't scrub too hard to avoid the car paint from coming off. More DIY videos are on the way, so please check them out. Until then, ciao! If you want more information about our products, please visit our website at www.sunnyscoper.co.kr. You can also email us if you have any questions. I've put the email address down below.